and we're back with another review. Today it'll be the Crudo Knives Caraceno 10. Go ahead and open that up. I wanted to do this knife because uh, an employee here at Atlantic Knife got this and I saw it and thought that's somewhat interesting. So let's go ahead and uh, do a review on it. We'll start off by talking about the specs. Eight inches overall. Weight is six ounces. The blade length is 3.5. Blade thickness comes in at about 1 8 or 0 0.187. HCR 18 mob 9. Uh, frame lock. Has carbon fiber. It says inserts, but I kind of see them more as onlays. Ceramic ball bearing washers. It's designed by Louis Crudo. I believe it was manufactured in uh, China. It has a open um, look to it for the inside of the frame. Helps lighten it up. I did mention this frame lock. It has a very sturdy clip on it. An interesting thumb stud that also works as sort of jimping would work to keep you from going past on the blade when cutting. It also has jimping on the blade. Has a nice boxy look to it. Well polished and finished here for the uh, back spacer. It has two raised screws. I always point out raised screws because I particularly do not like them. But I imagine it's for the reversible pocket clip so you can go side to side with it. Put them on the other side. All right, let's show you how this thing cuts. We'll bring out some paracord. Cuts right through it. Pushes through that nicely. Try this part of the blade. Pulls through that. Bring over some cardboard here. I want to try to use this thumb stud here both ways. Wow. It's kind of nice. Well, this blade retails at a uh, I believe it's around 165. I think we have it for around 145, something like that. Seems to be a nice little blade, has a lanyard hole. <clears throat> the blade uh, itself is referred to as uh, the Strict 9, is what uh, the designer calls it. Kind of matching the Carceno 10. Little play on words there. We like the little uh, design on the pivot of the logo. Did find some interesting things about it. You could pretty much open this knife any way you want to. Top flipper, flipper on the back, thumb stud here. Ah, my hand was slipping there. Maybe a little too busy in this area, but you know, for versatility, you could open it pretty much any way you can think of. Seems to be a pretty sturdy blade. So on that note, if you're watching us on uh, IGTV or Instagram, make sure you follow us at Atlantic Knife and tap the like button. If you're watching on YouTube, subscribe to our channel. If you like what you see, and make sure you like this uh, video. On that note, this is the Crudo Knives Carcinio 10, and I am C with Atlantic Knife. Signing off.